हेलो फ्रेंड्स नमस्ते जय हिंद सो एज आई प्रोमिस यू दैट बाय नेक्स्ट वीक आई विल कम अप विद द सिलेबस ऑफ मास्टर्स स्पेशली टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट द एम ए इकोनॉमिक सिलेबस एंड इन कमिंग डेज आई विल बी डिस्कसिंग ईच एंड एवरीथिंग स्लोली तो फर्स्ट आई विल बी गिविंग द लिंक फॉर द लास्ट ईयर आई हैव अपलोडेड ए वन वीडियो ऑफ फिफ्टीन मिनट ऑलमोस्ट for ma economics its preparation syllabus uh, with for the hc university of hyderabad and today <coughs> is very special for the new students to aap logon ko ye dhyan rakhna hai kisi bhi ma entrance except dsc and isi be it jnu be it bhu be it hcu or any central university यू जी का मोस्टली सिलेबस आर फॉलोड दैट मीन्स यू जी मीन्स अंडर ग्रेजुएट जो आपने ग्रेजुएशन में पढ़ा है वही सिलेबस फॉलो किया जाता है यू टेक द रेफरेंस फॉर एग्जाम्पल बी एट बी एच यू का सिलेबस पटना यूनिवर्सिटी का सिलेबस डी यू का सिलेबस ऑल आर दीज आर अलाइंड ऑलमोस्ट एनी स्टेट यूनिवर्सिटी इवन यू टेक एंटायर थ्री ईयर्स का सिलेबस यू टेक यू कैन फाइंड आउट एनी सिलेबस ट्रस्ट में एनी यू जी सी के अंदर जो भी यूनिवर्सिटी है यू टेक द ग्रेजुएशन सिलेबस एंड बी थोड़ो विद दैट so basically i would like to categorize into six seven portions for this first and prime is microeconomics to so, sabse pehle aata hai microeconomics theek hai you note it down if possible uh, what are the basic <coughs> sections from where questions are asked so first thing is microeconomics then it comes macroeconomics micro macro macro itself covers money banking and all third is international economics or international trade some people call fourth is indian economy then comes fifth growth and development then comes six statistics and seventh maths or you can say that mathematical economics these are the broader seven portion and some portions like public finance current affairs the basic questions are asked even in public finance the basic theory of expenditure public goods externality फिजिकल पॉलिसीज टैक्सेशन सम बेसिक्स आर आस सो डोंट वरी अबाउट इट हाँ नाउ कमिंग टू द यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ हैदराबाद स्पेशली इफ यू हैव वेरी गुड कमांड ओवर दिस फाइव पर्सन माइक्रो मैक्रो डेवलपमेंट इंडियन इकोनॉमी एंड ग्रोथ एंड डेवलपमेंट माइक्रो मैक्रो इंडियन इकोनॉमी ग्रोथ एंड इंटरनेशनल इकोनॉमी दिस फाइव इयर्स सॉरी एगन आई एम रिपीटिंग माइक्रो मैक्रो ग्रोथ एंड डेवलपमेंट इंडियन इकोनॉमी एंड international economy if you have very good command of five this you can easily cover almost 80% of the question rest of the questions would be based on your some current affairs some public finance and almost 10 to 12 12 questions are asked on <coughs> this uh mathematical economics or statistical part so these are just basics mean median mode central tendency carl pearson wala regression and all these are just basics they are asking don't worry about it even in the any book you will get easily and i will be again giving the link you join there and you will get all the books free pdf are uploaded already there freely it is available freely trust me in the telegram group all the books and what books to be followed and what needs to be then everything i have already uploaded you just search in the youtube ma economics in trends preparation hcu navneet you will get the link and everything i have detailed so in coming days i will also discuss about the how the placement and how the universities the uh, department professors and everything for now <clears throat> i would like to tell you the these area you need to follow and again what you do take the papers from 2012 to 2021 this 9 to 10 years ka paper again you take the paper and make this six seven sections micro macro international trade this that in economy and all and again note down all the i mean segments the questions in those segments okay this wala micro ka hai that wala macro ka hai then you will have roughly 100 topics 100 to 120 topics and you just go through it trust me you go through it in the website if you go to the school of economics university of hyderabad if you go to the syllabus portion they have given a basic frameworks what gonna they are asked that consumer theory market then comes to macro economics classical keynesian all these things so you please go to the site again you can check it but what portion i have told you take those 
I mean topics or the sections like for development economics or growth and development for HCU I want to recommend to you to read that I see Jones, Thrillwal and all ML Jingan is enough for micro and macro HL Ahuja, HL Ahuja micro economics, HL Ahuja macro economics enough for Indian economy you can take Ramesh Singh or Uma Kapila or anyone Ramesh Singh is preferable for international economics Salvatore is Bible so these are the just basic books take it no one can stop you from getting into the HCU trust me you can easily get more than 60 marks and please keep your eyes open uh, current events what's going on especially in terms of this economics I mean the trade new blocks regional <coughs> agreements the budget survey I will be coming uh, with one more video with budget and survey and all especially when the exam is near most probably exam would be held in July again I told you the last video that CUCT and HCU has not finalized that the SU will be under the CU city so so far we should take that key SU will take the independent exam ha, if there is a CU city pattern still there is a chance key you will get admission if your preparation is the level of HCU and JNU trust me because these are the apex universities under India and the, it is found that CU city paper is relatively easier as compared to these universities so if your preparation is up to the mark of this level so you will pakka get admission trust me you again go to the back and repeat reiterate this video watch it again note it down everything i have mentioned now coming to placement and all this year uh, many placements are happening still it's going on i think around 10 lakh package is going minimum it was 4.6 i think something so between 5 to 10 easily you will get here packages no need to worry about packages and again let me tell you there are two subjects financial economics and general economics syllabus is same for the both for the financial there is a bit technical and their cutoff is also very less as compared to general economics but try to get admission into the general economics because the scope of general economics is very wide horizon is very you know wide and there is not much discrimination and all regarding getting the job and the demand of market because almost the curriculum and the professors and the faculties are almost same for both the uh, this financial and general because but whosoever is much more interested in mathematical portion or the quant portion they can go for the financial economics again let me tell you that general economics is preferable uh, please try to get admission into general economics in hcu if doesn't happen then financial economics so that's all i have detailed given the description of syllabus <coughs> again go to the my previous video everything i have discussed what need to be followed like if you have macro to macro may why seven and eight schools are there uh, like you have mercantilism then comes classical and all this kinsian new classical monetism new new this new kinsian uh, so many things are lucas wala rational expectation these are the basics you categorize into school wise and you read it out and you try to keep solving the paper again i would request you by end of at least february you please go with the one round of paper 2012 to 2021 it is uploaded on the website of the university you just google hcu past year paper you will get just google the first link you will get so it was the slavers description i think i am very clear about it again i am telling you you watch this video what you have to follow and you please go to the my previous video just google hcu navneet ma economics preparation and i would be also giving the link below so your syllabus portion is done past year paper and any undergraduate syllabus any university is the syllabus for ma economics in transfer hcu trust me so that's all guard guys and hope your coming year would be very fruitful very bright and stay safe take care of yourself and stay connected if you find this information to be worthy and it needs to be uh, shared so please share this video to your peers to your friends and start making small small groups of three four people and start studying because economics is very vast subject and it needs too much revision so sometimes peer study matters but don't make long group of 20 people 30 people in the name of study just waste your time so chalo then see you and please share this video to your peers and the friends who is interested because i have you know i come through that ki many people don't even know about university of hyderabad that there is such university and such a great university in terms of richness uh, it had such richness 
in terms of biodiversity flora fauna campus building so much scope is there so don't undermine it if you don't get dsc jnu so you are most welcome to the su chalo guys see you same in the next video next video i will be coming with the syllabus of anthropology and ma political science hope it was fruitful to you and if any doubt comes please comment below i will try to answer each and every comment thank you guys bye bye guys see you soon chaliye namaste please watch this video guys and please subscribe it and stay connected to for upcoming updates